Hey guys, it's Rosie. Welcome back. Today my family is leaving on a road trip. Um, we actually just decided to leave yesterday, so it's kind of been crazy packing, but we are going to Florida. We've been planning on going to Florida for months, but we actually just decided that we'd go today, yesterday, so we were not packed at all, but I think we're going to make it work. So, um, it's pretty early in the morning. Actually, it's not that bad, but I think we're going to be trying to do the drive in two days, and I think it's about, like, 24 hours each way. So, should be fun, but yeah, let's go get in the car. So I haven't filmed the talking segment in a while because um, it's been it's been quite a trip, we'll just say. So we left on Tuesday pretty early in the morning and we were able to make it to North Carolina. Um, we got Shake Shack on the way so I had a lot of fun with that. Then the next day we went to Congaree National Park and we stopped at a park to visit my cousin, of course like socially distanced. After Ocala we went to a spring, it was called Rainbow Springs, it was really really beautiful. Um, it was a state park too so that was really cool. Um, we rented kayaks and we just went kayaking around. Um, after that we went mountain biking at Santos Trailhead. Um, that was actually really cool, we didn't have our um, good mountain bikes we left those home so we kind of just had like 
older bikes. We weren't really able to do some of the manufactured um, features at the trailhead, but we instead just rode on the single track, um, and I had a lot of fun with that. Um, after that, we went to Melbourne and stayed a night there, um, and then we drove down the um, Barrier Islands uh, and went to some of the, I don't know if it was a state park, just some sort of park there. Um, oh, I think it was a National Wildlife Refuge. Then we headed down to Fort Lauderdale because we had a booking uh, for a whole week to stay at a Airbnb condo. And we got there and we carried all of our stuff up like three flights of stairs. And we got in the place and it was pretty gross. Um, it just did not look like what the pictures looked like. So we decided we didn't want to stay there. So um, we tried to get our money back and everything, and I'm not sure what's gonna happen with that, but um, we did not wanna stay there. It was pretty icky, we'll just say. So then we came back and we had to stay like in between Jupiter and Fort Lauderdale because we couldn't stay at the condo that we had originally booked. So it's been quite a um, experience. So it's actually the next day. We stayed at that um, hotel, it was pretty nice, but now we are in, I don't know, we're, we're near Jupiter, and we went to the beach today, we also went mountain biking again. Um, everything has just been like kind of a mess. We planned on staying at that place, now we have nowhere to stay, so we're just bouncing from hotel and motel to hotel and motel. But I have been having a lot of fun um, getting some sun and just being in the warm weather, so I hope you enjoyed seeing um, the first week of our trip. Um, hopefully we'll be able to find somewhere to settle down because I've basically just been living out of my backpack with just like random food we pick up at the supermarket. So uh, I'm hoping that we'll be able to find somewhere that we'll stay at least for like two or three nights that, so that I can start because it is 2021 now and I haven't even started my bullet journaling yet because I expected that we were gonna like stop somewhere we haven't yet, so I will let you guys know when that happens, but as of now, we're kind of just going around, but I have been having a lot of fun with it, so make sure to check out part two, which will be coming in a week, and then part three maybe? I mean, we have no plans as to how long we're going to stay here, but as of now, it's probably going to be two to three weeks, so... I have no idea, but thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you will come back and check out part two and or three. Also follow me on all social media for more daily updates at Rosie Revolts. And um, check out my Etsy shop also at Rosie Revolts and my book at gadotoysbook.com. And I will see you guys later. Bye.